Hello, my festive lovelies. From today and until the end of the year, I'll be uploading a New Year's appropriate nail design every day. And today I'm starting this theme with this blinged up marble design. So to begin with, I'm painting the nails with Twilight Lilac and Ego by Madden Glam. Four of the nails will be painted with Twilight Lilac and one with Ego. It's the days leading up to New Year's and I wanted to do designs for the occasion. People want their nails special to celebrate bringing in the New Year so I thought I'd put together a few New Year's designs. But don't be expecting the traditional designs for New Year's like a clock and champagne glasses. No, none of that for me thanks. Instead I'm doing six designs that you would wear to celebrate the New Year coming in without the nails being too cliché. So I've applied two coats to all the nails and cured them, except for the nail that I'm doing the marble nail design on. For that nail, I'm painting random black lines into the wet layer using Perfect Black by Madame Glam. Then I still don't cure it because I'm going in with Perfect White and painting in around the black lines. Because the gel polishes are still wet, the colour should melt together theoretically and cause a marbled look. I can't claim credit for this technique, but I also can't give credit where it's due because I saw this technique on Instagram and I unfortunately didn't save the post to refer back to. So if any of you know the post I'm talking about and know the artist, please comment their details below. I'm just continuing adding white and bringing it up close to the black lines. And as I'm doing this, I'm noticing it's not looking how I remembered it did. And like I said before, I didn't save the post to go back to and have a, another look at, so I'm working from memory and I'm trying to make this marble nail work. I'm actually not happy with how it's looking and it's not looking like what I remembered it did, so I'm trying to save the situation by using a clean detail brush and brushing through the black lines, but it looks like I'm just making it worse. So on that note, I'm going to cure this nail and leave it as it is. Hopefully some bling will save it. So while the marble nail is curing in my LED light, I add no wipe top coat to the rest of the nails. And by the time I've done that, the marble nail has cured and I can add gold lines through it. I'm using metallic gold by Madame Glam and a fine detail nail art brush to paint random gold lines through this quote unquote marble nail. I let the metallic gel polish air dry for a little bit before I cure it in my light and then add no wipe top coat to it and cure it for a final time. For the nails that I'm adding the chunky charms to, I'm using builder gel to attach them. And just before I add the charms to the nail, I paint no wipe top coat over the builder gel. This will make sure the builder gel isn't tacky after curing. So I press into it the gold charms I got off eBay and once they're in the position I want, I give them a full cure in my LED light. I'm doing exactly the same thing to this nail but I'm only adding one gold charm at the top of the nail and gold studs underneath it before curing it in my LED light. And here's the finished design. Be sure to let me know down below in the comments if you like this set. If you enjoyed this video hit that like button and if you haven't already please consider subscribing to my channel that way you won't miss any episodes I upload during my New Year series. So that's all I have for you today. I'll catch you all here again tomorrow for the next episode of my daily New Year's nail art. Bye!